This video will show you how to add a banner to your back office. When you first log in, once again, this is your dashboard. This is where you'll come to when you log in. You'll go up to the top right where you see your name. And you got to left click for the drop down. And then you go down here and you got to left click on banners. Once you've left click on banners, it'll bring you to this page right here. And once again, you got to see a buy button. This is to be able to add your banner. You do not have to pay anything at this time. So you need to look over here to see which one you want to create. A 468, a 728, or a 125 by 125 banner. And you also want to make sure that your image URL matches the banner that you select. I'm going to select the first one up here, the 468. So I'm going to left click on buy. Now it's got to take me to this page to create my banner. Now once again, the title and the text doesn't really matter. It's just for your purposes. It's not going to show up. It's just for your back office. Now this is what does matter, but you do have to fill this in. You have to fill the title and the text with something or you will get an error. So the target URL, the image URL. Now, the first thing I'm going to do is I'm going to put my image URL in here. Okay, this is my image URL, and it should end with a JPEG, a GIF. Like you see, this one has a PNG because it's not a GIF. A GIF is one that flashes or moves, or JPEG, JPG. All your images should end up in one of those type of uh, letters or forms for your URL image. Next, I got to put in the target URL. The target URL is the website they're going to go to, and it's your referral link. So when they see your banner, they're going to click on your banner. It's going to take them to your website with your referral link, so you immediately will get credit if they sign up under you. So this is what we need to do. Once this is done, you got to left click on register. Right here you see, ad has been created. That means what you did was successful. Otherwise, you would get an error in something in red. It would not come up ad created. So now right here, I'm going to click left click on go to banners. And now you'll see my banner has been formed. Here it is right here. Okay? And we'll go into on how to purchase clicks and what have you and edit later. If you want to edit all you got to do is click on edit. If you want to delete it, all you have to do is click on delete. And you can always, if you accidentally delete it with credits on it, don't worry. You don't lose anything and you can restore it if you like. So here's my first banner that I've created. That's the way you create a banner. We'll talk about purchases later in another video.